All right. So now here we're, de we're dealing with a rational equation with a whole number with whole numbers in the denominator, um, five, two, and ten. And so the first step in this process, uh, there's probably several ways you can go about this, but the first step is you want to get a common denominator. And so between 5, 2, and 10, your common denominator would be 10. So what that means is you have to multiply this side here by 2 over 2, this middle part by 5 over 5, because that would make 10, and the last part by 1. Well, we're not worried about that. So now we'd have 4t times, give me a second for it to catch up with me, 4t times 3t plus 1 over 10. My, uh, minus or plus a negative 5 and then t plus 1 over 10. Changing the subtraction to addition here and changing the sign to the right. And then equals 1 tenth. Now the reason we do that is because now we can simplify this by just multiplying the entire equation by the denominator. And our denominator is 10. So if you do that, you in essence have 10 over 1 times 4t times 3t plus 1 over 10. And I don't require my students to show this step, but I think it's good to see. 10 over 1 times negative 5 times t plus 1 over 10 equals 10 over 1 again times 1 tenth. So I'm, I multiplied every group in, I distributed the 10 through and multiplied it into each group of, of expression. So what that does then is that means the 10s cancel out in every case. And so you're left with a much more manageable equation of 4t times 3t plus 1 plus negative 5 times t plus 1 equals 1. Now it's just solved um, uh, however it needs to be solved. So the first thing I'd do here is distribute. So you'd have uh, 12t squared plus 4t minus 5t minus 5 equals 1. Just combine like terms. Uh, 12t squared doesn't combine with anything. 4t and negative 5t is negative 1t minus 5 equals 1. Um, since it's a, a quadratic, the t squared term, we're going to have to move everything left and factor it. So the 1's all we need to move left. Or use the quadratic formula. So 12t squared minus 1t minus 6 equals 0, and it's ready to factor. So minus minus is a minus plus. Um, 12 uh, breaks into 3 and 4, or, um, yeah, we'll just, we'll just try it here. 3t and 4t and see if it works. 6 breaks into 2 and 3, so I'll put a 2 and a 3 there. And negative 8, positive 9, my signs are wrong, so that means it should have been plus and minus. So now we got 8t and negative 9t, it's correct, so set each piece to 0 and solve them. And so minus the 2, divide by 3, so t is equal to negative 2 thirds, and t is equal to 3 fourths. And we found the two answers that satisfy the equation. Now, it might be to your benefit to make sure you're right to take the negative two-thirds and three-fourths and plug it in to the original equation.